Remember the old auto gyro? Well, meet its grandson, the gyrocopter. Now, this machine may look like a mini helicopter, but right there is where the similarity ends. And as I'm no expert, and as I am bobbling these words, let's cut. Most of us are pretty careful when we get into our automobile. Oh, shit, I forgot to turn up the fucking engine. We begin our review of your favorite south of the border in Acapulco, where we found Los Voladores, the flying Indians. I still don't know what he's got to do with the story. said that it's better to meet danger than to wait for it. In the next 30 minutes, you are going to meet a very special breed of cat. Men who can't wait to meet danger. They chase it, challenge it, and lick it. Now, when I want to examine an alligator, there's a certain little spot I hit. And all you have to do is press it real hard. And one little quick twist, and that's mobilizing there for the time being. And when I get through with my examination, all I have to do is just touch him lightly, and he wakes right up. If Chris loses his cool in that crowd, the hunting season would suddenly open with Chris as the game. Researchers recently found some film taken in 1956 of the Royal New Zealand Air Force team. The planes they flew were de Havilland vampires and were the first Allied jets in operation in World War II. We thought you'd enjoy a look into the past at one of the first of the jet aerobatic teams. The team was made up of flight leader John Buckmaster, flying officer Adam Anderson, Lieutenant Colin Rudd, and flying officer Trevor Bland. The flight leader has the most critical role. If he makes a mistake, the rest of the flight will be in trouble. Wilson, Daredevil Cameraman, Thrill Seeker.